Ryan Borutsky couldn't help but smile at the thought of potentially pitching a major league game in the home stadium of the Chicago White Sox. That's something the Blue Jays' left-hander has been thinking about since childhood. Blue Jays pitcher Ryan Borutsky lowered his era to 2.79 after his last start, third best among Blue Jays starters through their first five outings, delightfully surprising his manager along the way, Carlos Osorio, Toronto star file photo, Borutsky, who grew up in Mundelein, ill, less than 70 kilometers from the Southside Chicago Stadium, could start Sunday at Guaranteed Rate Field to cap a three-game road series against the team he cheered for as a kid, oh, it would be great, Borutsky beamed. I don't know if I'll get too nervous about it, I don't usually get too nervous about anything. But it's definitely going to be a lot to take in, a lot of people who have been with me my whole life will come out to watch me, but it's going to be more excitement than nerves. Article continued below Borutsky chose to root for the White Sox over the Cubs as a kid, thanks in part to his father's affinity for the Southsiders. But he also got to watch a group of talented players, including his idol Mark Burel, bring a World Series to Chicago in 2005 when Borutsky was just 11 years old. Borutsky wears no. 56 as an homage to Burel, the longtime White Sox lefty who capped his career with three seasons in Toronto from 2013 to 2015. And he has found success mimicking Burel's quick style on the mound. Read more, opinion, Richard Griffin, Ryan Borutsky still searching for first win as offense, defense failed to support him against Twins Blue Jays trade reliever Sung Wino to Colorado Rockies Jays notebook, all that's missing for Ryan Borutsky is the wins, my case of how I pitch working fast, just trying to attack the zone with strikes and not trying to overpower anybody, that's what he always did, Borutsky said of the lessons he took from watching Bureau over the years. Article continued below, it's cool to get to be able to wear his number now and just kinda do the things he's done and hopefully, if I'm lucky, have a career just like him. Borutsky made his MLB debut against the defending World Series champion Astros in Houston last month, holding their potent lineup to two runs over six innings. 24-year-old has added three more quality starts since then, including Tuesday's loss to the Minnesota Twins when he allowed two unearned runs over six frames. Borutsky lowered his era to 2.79, with that last start, third best among Blue Jays starters through their first five outings, delightfully surprising his manager along the way, he's gotten off to a better start than I thought he would. John Gibbons said, while Sunday's starter officially remained undetermined as of Wednesday, Borutsky would be on regular rest for the series finale with Toronto off Thursday. The team was hoping to have right-hander Marco Estrada back from a left glute strain by the weekend, but a setback and a rehab start Tuesday night, Estrada left a Triple-A game in the fourth inning with a blister on his right middle finger, paved the way for Borutsky to fulfill his childhood dream in Chicago. And Gibbons is okay with that, it would be kinda neat for him to pitch there. I know he wants to, Gibbons said. Maybe that worked out just perfect, we'll see, anytime you can make a dream come true type thing, I like that. Eventually he'd probably pitch there anyway, but it would be kinda nice to happen in his first call up. The last month, Borutsky's high school team in Mundelein held a watch party at a local restaurant when Borutsky made his debut in Houston. The rookie expects a large cheering section to show up in Chicago throughout the three-game series, especially if he ends up starting Sunday, there'll be a lot of people, Borutsky said. I'd say if I'm pitching, there will be a good 100, maybe 200 people there to watch that game, it'll be definitely cool to pitch there. It's going to be a lot of fun.